JJJ, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Listen, today we're going to talk about why teaching yourself is actually better than going to school, right? Let's let's start by going to school, right? Let's start with the topic of going to school for, you know, you go from kindergarten to 12th grade of high school. Then from there, you go four years of college, right? Sometimes even more. And like, let's say you have this passion of, you know, building things, programming and coding. A lot of times in school, what they teach you is a lot of theory. From what I've noticed in, you know, in job in the job environment, is pretty much a lot of times uh, students who are graduating with a computer science degree or mechanical engineering or electrical engineering, when it comes to, uh, you know, comparing them with somebody who taught themselves how to code and how to become a programmer most of the time the programmer is actually a better coder than the computer science major almost all the time now one thing that they do have that's actually better than teaching yourself is they get a lot of fundamentals stuff that like let's say for example like right now like let's say an example you guys you guys is over here and trying to learn web development right a lot of people don't don't look into how important it is to actually know databases, right? So pretty much people think it's just HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And that's it. They created a web page and that's it. They think that that's all you need to become a, a you know a developer or a programmer. But they don't teach you what well, they don't look into learning actually databases and you know uh, the whole nine, right? Now, when you actually in school, like let's say um, in college, because I actually took one year of computer science, but I just didn't like it because there was too much theory. But going back to the topic, uh, in that first year, I remember I had like like three calculus classes. Uh, on top of that, it was just mostly uh, theory. But one thing that I did uh, uh, get and I was grateful was an uh, introduction to databases. And I think if I didn't have that introduction to databases, I wouldn't understand a lot of the topics in the early stages of me learning how to become a web developer, right? So I think in that sense is good for those guys that have a computer science major. Um, but at the same time, a lot of times, I'll be seeing it all the time. There's guys out there who who went straight from high school to just learning by themselves on um, learning how to code when they was like 17. So by now, when they become like 24, 25, these guys are, are freaking geniuses. You know what I mean? While the other kid who went to college and was like, oh, yeah, I'm just going to college and I'm going to do this four years. It's not even half half as prepared as the other kid that actually taught himself why because he one kid is doing it by himself in his house and he's coding 8 to 12 hours now this other kid is only coding projects when they give him homework there's a big difference and that's that's the thing that people don't understand when you go into school a lot of people think like hey uh, I'm doing all the projects from my class the teacher taught me how to create a, a web page and then I go and I create a little bullshit page uh, an about me page and then that's it you know but the other kid is actually looking online what's the best ways to create a, a website how to you know add javascript html css how to do uh you know a whole bunch of stuff that you know adding frameworks while the kid that's actually in college is not doing anything it's just getting basics you know sometimes they teach you you know stuff like uh what is it Java or like C sharp and yeah it's good to you know learn those programming languages but at the same time like comparing it to a kid who's been coding since like 17 you can't even compare them because the the kid who's been coding since 17 is so much more prepared than uh, the kid who went to college that's my opinion that's from what I've seen of course there's gonna be people who's gonna say hey you know, like, I went to college, and I'm a great developer. 
I'm, I went to college and I did this and that and you know like a lot of times man yes that's great that's you know good for you that you went to college and, and you know you did your four years but don't you think it would have been better if you would have actually been programming and coding for four years every day you know eight hours a day instead of doing a whole bunch of like psychology classes sociology class uh, history a whole bunch of stuff that you're like why am I in this class why am I paying so much money just for this this BS and then that's when somebody might say hey that's why you go to a boot camp but then that's the same problem too because in a boot camp they're gonna teach you the basics they're not teaching you anything beyond the basics they're not teaching you uh, something like you know uh, to become a, a great developer they're just gonna teach you hey learn you know learn loops learn uh, conditionals this is how you create a page and you put it up online on Heroku you can learn that online like you don't need those guys man like it, it's pretty crazy so I would say hey you know four years degree comparing it to a kid who is 17 years old and been coding since 17 and now it's 24 years old so imagine like this a 24 year old with a degree and a 24 year old without a degree but has been doing it since 17 has been coding since 17 with a large portfolio comparing it to a kid who just graduated from school and all he's doing is pretty much just doing the homework that they give him every two weeks and one final project every six months come on guys you can't even be you can't compare it you know what I mean so it's up to you if you really want to take a you know four years of school get yourself in debt well I will say hey don't do it you know what I mean anyways man this is your boy Joe back at it again man listen we got a lot of good things coming up next week so make sure you you keep watching my videos the quality is gonna be better the cameras coming in is way better I'm getting a whole room that's gonna be just a studio just for us to basically create videos for you guys and um, yeah and thanks everybody who's actually been buying courses on you know on Udemy like what you guys don't understand is that even if you guys don't buy the courses that I'm providing to you guys because you click on the link it, I actually get a little something right and what I'm going to be doing next week is I'm going to interview basically the students who I gave them free courses right and you guys are gonna actually see what where your money is going to you know because you gotta think about it you're buying these courses but you're not buying it just because I'm telling you hey buy these courses because they're actually good and those are the courses that I learned but at the same time you're doing it because you want to help out other people you know what I mean like if the course is only fifteen dollars and you're gonna get 40 hours of a video of like basically tutorials and learning the full process of becoming a, a web developer and you spend fifteen dollars pretty much and then I make a dollar and from that dollar I give 40 cents to the the students all that stuff start adding up you know what I mean so you guys are putting money in I'm putting money in and let's just help each other out man this there's a lot of people who, who definitely need the help right now, man. And, you know, today Trump became president. So you don't know where we're going to be at in, you know, a year, two years from now. So I'd rather, you know, help people out and be like, please, God, if things go bad, at least know that I'm, you know, I'll try helping people out, you know, so. Anyways, man, it's your boy Joe. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you like my videos, man. Also, to click, click like, man. Click share on Facebook. Share on something, man. Thanks to Miss Lorraine, I appreciate it. I see when you know when people actually share it. I really, really appreciate it because if we don't share it, then nobody knows that these videos exist. You know what I mean? So, anyways, make sure you take care of yourself and you already know. Holla at your kid. Wow.